Thank you. What are you? What are- Oh my god! That guy was about to shoot my ass with a tank! I am now in the tank! Oh my god! Die! <laughs> uh, using your own weapons against you? Oh shit! What's going on YouTube? This is Darklight here, coming at you with another Let's Play and welcome to Shadowbug. Now, this is an indie game that was sent to me directly from a developer who is so generous to send me this game for free. Of course, as always, I'm gonna leave some links down in the description below so you guys can check this game out for yourselves. And what this is, is it's a platformer game where you play as a little bug ninja. In order to get through the levels, you need to click on enemies and dash to attack them. And that dashing action is gonna be a core component in getting through a lot of these levels. So let's go ahead and jump into the game, shall we? Let's go ahead and start a new game. I did already go through the tutorial here, but I'm going to show you guys anyway. I got three stars because I was awesome at the tutorial link. Uh, you have to play this game with a mouse and keyboard. You can't really play this with a controller because you need to be able to click on the enemies. D goes right. Boom. A goes left. Pretty simple so far. There's not a jump button, but you need to be able to click on enemies in order to move. Bop, bop, bop. Triple combo. Hiya! All right. Of course, my time was kind of shitty because I was explaining things a little bit at the beginning, but hey. I still got three ninja stars. All right. So that was basically the tutorial level to teach you how to play. And now we're going to get into stuff that I have not done. Strange Pipes, the first legit level. All right, let's see if we can do this. Hi, y'all. Hi, ya. Die, please. Uh, and you're going to need that. Need to do that to get over. Hi, ya. All right. Click on that to jump over. And there's nothing else I can click on. I wonder what these little lights are for. Are they important? Oh, I can also, like, dash through floors. That's pretty cool. Uh, Hiya! All right. Level wasn't even too much of a problem. Did I get three ninja stars? Yes! Three stars! New best time, of course. I guess the uh, the one on the right is what you need to beat in order to, uh, to get a star for that. So cool. Pretty simple so far. I imagine it's just going to get way more difficult as it goes on. Overhill. All right, come at you, hi -ya! Jump through the floor, click on you. What are these lights for? I'm really curious, I'm super curious. Is it just for points, basically? To try to get a higher rating? Uh, uh, these are pretty cool looking. They're like little winged demons. Oh man, that freaking combo though that I had going on, holy shit, that, I did really well that, that freaking, uh, that level. I was gonna say that episode, I did. Quite well that that level. Well, all right, doing pretty good so far. Jump good is the name of this level. All right, kill some of these awesome looking bat thingies. Is it, did I screw myself? Okay, no, never mind. They, they do respawn. Cool. Just in case. Make sure I don't drop down into the spikes. Just click like mad. Just click like mad. One thing to the next. One thing to the next. All right. Uh. The more I can go without hitting the ground, the better. All right. Oh, I almost fell. <laughs> that would have been bad. That could have been very bad. Just keep going, just keep going, just keep going. And drop down. Yeah! Come on, you gotta give me three stars for that. Under 25 seconds? Holy shit. That would have been uh, really, really freaking difficult. I guess if I went through that a couple times, it wouldn't have been so bad. All right, hype fest. Let's go. Let's do this. Uh, uh, I got you. Uh. All right. This is this game actually feels really cool though. I love the little like puzzle aspect. It really focuses on the jumping, on the dashing to attack people. It's like very central on that. Black belt achievement unlocked. Nice. Oh, 18 seconds. Oh, I did pretty awesomely. I just I didn't collect enough orbs, but. Still got two stars, but I think I did. I made really good time, at least. Spike Alley. Oh, that means there's gonna be a lot of freaking spikes. Jump down here. Yeah. I need to, to be mindful of getting as many of these orbs as I can while still going through this quickly. But all right, no problem. Oh shit! <laughs> I almost got hit by that guy. Uh. Oh, now I gotta go down. Downward dashing, and I gotta not fall into the spikes. All right. No problem! Alright, three stars? Three stars? Oh, I didn't get enough orbs, damn it. I still think I did pretty well. Alright, level six cleared. Open sesame. Ugh, I don't know. I don't know, hopefully it goes okay. Oh, these are levers. This is a new mechanic, isn't it? I'm gonna need to, oh yep, I'm gonna need to figure out these levers. Like, uh, yeah! Oh no! <laughs> No! 
okay, cool. No, no worries. No worries. It's fine. Everything is gonna be Daijobu! I almost hit that spike. Hiya! Luckily, luckily, the levers aren't really, like, tricky right now. I'm really concerned in the future that they're gonna be, like, levers that I need to, like, puzzle and figure out. Uh, all right. Not, not even a problem. Collect the- oh shit, no! Oh my god! No! That was the first time I died, guys. That sucked. That straight up sucked. That straight up sucks. All right, let's get this lever. Uh, okay. Get these orbs, because I need them. Does it give me a time penalty if I die, maybe? Oh, what's the downside to dying? That's a good question. Let's go ahead and click this switch. Get these orbs, click on that. Kill you. That down here again. Alright, that was a pretty simple puzzle. It's just gonna get more complicated, I already know. The only thing I missed was time, and only by six seconds, so I didn't do too badly. I did die once, unfortunately. Alright, march. Are we almost clear with like the first section? Is that is that what I'm seeing? Mmm, mmm, mmm. A, a wild axe appears. I guess it's because I, I killed this new enemy type. He wants to ax me a question? Ugh. Die, please. Die, please. Oh, man. Oh, no. No. Okay, I think I could have gotten those orbs if I would have actually managed to click on him effectively. hey -ya! And I'm a badass little bug ninja. Just kills everything in one hit. It's pretty awesome. I wonder if there are, like, boss fights in this. That would be pretty interesting. I don't know if there are any, like, real, like, boss encounters. Uh, uh, uh. Get those orbs. Thank you. What are you? What are... Oh, my God. That guy was about to shoot my ass with a tank. I am now in the tank. Oh, my God. Die. <laughs> uh, using your own weapons against you. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, so... Um, uh, oh shit! Oh shit! No! 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 Oh god! I tried to! I tried! I tried, guys, to click on it, and it didn't work. All right. Oh no! I thought I was attacking the thing. You know? Ow! This is hard. This part became difficult somehow. Is this a boss? I gotta try to hit the green orb while going over him, basically. I need to not be so preempted. There we go. Okay. Yeah. I guess this is like a boss. I need to wait for him to come. Oh shit! Oh shit! No! What the what the actual fuck? How how do I attack you? What do I do even? All right, show me your weakness. I need give me something, something to work with. Oh, there we go. I got you. Oh no! I hit the I hit the saw, guys. Oh my god, you gotta start this fight completely over after you die? That is such bullshit. Oh my god, guys. The difficulty curve in this freaking fight is insane. Like, I thought I was doing pretty well. I was clearing levels, I thought it was gonna be a cakewalk, we're gonna get through this no problem because I'm awesome. Then all of a sudden I hit this motherfucker, and now I don't know if I'm gonna be able to clear it. Uh, no, don't hit the saw plate. Why, fam? Why do you gotta have so many saw blades? You got this giant drill in the front, you got two saw blades in the front right behind your drill, and then you got like more saw blades in the back and it's ridiculous, okay? It's just too much. You got too much going on, fam. All right, I hit him the one time, I gotta avoid this drill bullshit. Huh. I gotta try to kill as many bats as I can here, try not to get fucking killed. Huh. Use the bat dashes to get out of the way of the damn drill piece. All right, okay, here comes that. Uh, hit that. Go over the saw blade and don't get hit by it, because that would fucking suck. How much time do I gotta hit this motherfucker? All right, I'm gonna try to save some bats to... All right, get over him. Sweet. All right, he's getting faster now, unfortunately. Uh, uh, uh. All right! All right, I only had to hit him three times. Sweet. I was legit worried. Boom. Hey, I actually made it on time. Nice. All right. Let's move on. Whoo! First boss. Kind of problem in the streets. Boom. Am I in a new area now? The flower pit. All right. First boss, boss clear. 
Loss clear. First boss clear. We can do this. All right, now we gotta worry about projectiles. That's new. We gotta worry about plants spitting shit at us. Don't get hit by the acid. That would be pretty bad. All right. Try to drop into these orbs here, because I need them. It's cool that I actually get to, like, pull orbs into me if I just get close enough. Whew. I almost got hit by that plant there. That would have been shitty. All right. But did you respawn? Please don't do that. No, please don't. Just please don't. Let me try to fall down in here. No. Oh, oh man. Close calls. But yeah. Hi, y'all. All right. Now where do I go? Where go? What do? You can't. You can't throw all these directions at me, fam. I need to know what to do next. Where do I go and what do I do? Oh, there's a big orb here. Sweet. Aya. All right, guys. So, your boy got stuck. <laughs> and uh, it took me a little bit to figure this out, but I think what I need to do is actually flip this switch right here to close that off. So that way I don't get murdered. And then go all the way back up here. Haboosh. Flip the switch again. Kill him, because fuck him and everything he stands for. And go down here. And then, here we go. All right. We're making progress. We're making strides and doing things. Okay, now how do I, how do I do? What the fuck? I, I need to get over there. Your, your boy needs to get over there somehow. Okay, it's, it's fine. I was worried about dropping down in the pit. I needed to do that in uh, 54 seconds. Uh, 54 seconds. I did it in three minutes and a half. <laughs> I I was I was doing shitty in that one, but we figured it out. All right, that's level nine. I think we're just gonna go ahead and do the tenth one, Rose Garden. I think ten levels is good for a let's play, maybe, possibly. All right, let's do that. Hiya! All right, no problem at all. Jump from plant to plant to plant and flip this switchy switch. Hapoosh! What do you do? Oh shit! Okay, you actually make my life easier, even though. The idea was probably to uh, to murder my face more effectively. All right, the switch. Ah yeah, and I fucked up. There we go. Uh, uh. What? Oh, I dashed into spikes. My life, basically, basically my life. All right. All right, guys, let's just just take a breather. I'm just gonna take a breather, and it'll be daijobu. It'll all be fine. Let's not jump into the plants. Let's go down here and flip the switch. Let's kill him. Not jump into the spikes like a genius. Like a genius. All right. Kill him. And it'll all be Daijo. Let mm, get these orbs if I can. Thank you. Uh. All right. And we win. I did restart the level. That's why I got it in 40 seconds. And uh, we only got 415 orbs out of 600 whatever. So anyway. Level 10. Done. Mad birds. How many... Okay, so we're actually two away from the next the next boss encounter, I think, right? Let's go ahead. Let's go and try to make it to the next boss fight. Why not? Oh, we'll, do, we'll do Mad Birds, and we'll do the next one, and it'll all begin. Oh, it's rainy. That's different. Hiya! All right. Kill him. That's like a nice change in atmosphere. I really like the rainy level. Now, these orbs of death, they really concern me. I'm guessing they're like mines? Ugh. Let's not land on them wherever they drop them. That would be fucking terrible. Die, please. Alright. We can do this. Oh, shit! Oh, no! No! no. <laughs> oh, God. God damn it. Alright, that was a little bit disconcerting. <laughs> not gonna lie. Oh, shit! So many saw blades in this. So many saw blades and spikes and things that want to murder me. Oh. Okay. Oh no! That's gonna be hard. Okay, I need to basically fall enough to where I won't dash into the saw blade and then click. The dash mechanic is just getting a lot more complicated, and I don't need to get plant acid in the face. That's bad. Plant acid in the face is bad, just in case you were wondering. All right, guys, we got this this time, no problem. Cut him, drop down here, dash to him, and score! 10-point landing, all right. 
That's, I may have done a little bit shitty in that level. Um, I was supposed to complete it in 58 seconds and uh, complete it in two and a half minutes. So, uh, my bad, my bad. All right, Blade Maze. That seems like a fun level. That's gonna be awesome. Let's do it. All right, Blade Maze, let's go. Another rainy level. I really like that you can tell what the atmosphere of the level is going to be in the uh, the level select screen because like it looks like the the skies turn dark whenever I selected this level. Shit! Oh my god! How how do even? This one's going to be difficult as shit. I can already tell this one's going to be hard. Fuck. All right, dash down here. Uh, yeah, made it. All right, dash from here to here. Can we do it? Can we make it? Yes. All right. Get this lever. Use you to get up here. Sweet. And let's jump up here. Oh no, the, the shrine was right there, guys. It was right there. I saw it with my eyeballs. I just needed to make an extra push. Uh, no, I needed to click sooner. All right, got there. And got you. All right. Click from here to here and score. Boom! That one was a lot easier than the initial one. In fact, I got three stars. Nice! Alright, let's go ahead and jump to Lumberbug. I think this is going to be actually the last one that I do today. Because I don't want this video to run too, too long. You guys pretty much get the idea of what this game is like at this point. I would have liked to have gotten to the next boss, but unfortunately it doesn't look like we're going to get there today. Holy shit! And this looks difficult! Uh, okay, cool. We made it! Next checkpoint, I think, maybe. Oh my god. This is gonna be a pain in the butt. No. Aha! Aha! I made it out of sheer dumb luck. Nice! Oh shit! No! I did not, however, make that. That was a pain. Alright. Flip that. Ooh, man. This one is nerve wracking as shit. I can definitely see where this game is gonna get more and more difficult. For damn sure. Alright, we can do this, we can do this. Uh, 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 hi-ya! Hi-ya! Alright, no, we got this, we got this, no problem, no problem, don't get anxious, don't get anxious. Oh, god! Oh, shit, I, I was saying don't get anxious, but I was getting really fucking anxious. No! Alright, the shrine's right there, let's do it! Yes! Yes, 46 seconds! Oh. <sighs> Guys, that one was a heart attack. How many more levels we got to the end? Three more levels to the boss. Yeah, we're not going to go ahead and do three more levels. I think we're going to go ahead and call it an episode here. This is actually a really fun indie game. I had a lot more fun with this than I thought I would. It's actually one of the more fun, random little indie games that I've been sent so far. So thank you guys very much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please do me a huge favor and share this video with your friends. It really and truly means a lot more to me. You guys know it really helps me out getting that kind of exposure. Do me a favor, drop some comments too. Let's talk about this game. I love hearing from you guys. I just love chatting with you guys. It really and truly makes my day. And if you haven't the subscribe button yet, you guys know that I'd love to have you guys as a member of the Arclight family. And then we'll continue a brand new journey together again very, very soon. Until then, may your dreams at your darkest hour, and I'll see you next time.